stage one tanks passing for flight. One, zero, ignition, go off. And we've had successful liftoff of the Falcon 9 rocket as we see all nine of those first stage Merlin engines glowing beautifully, carrying Telstar 19 Vantage to geostationary transfer orbit. Now upon ascent, we go through max Q as our first milestone. And again, that's the maximum aerodynamic pressure. It's an important milestone because it means that from that moment on, we're going through thinner and thinner atmosphere and less and less stress. Vehicle has reached maximum aerodynamic pressure. And we've got that confirmation on the nets that we have gone through max Q. So again, less and less stress in the vehicle as we go up and up from here on out. Now, we're going to come through three events in pretty quick succession, and those are Miko, then stage separation, and then second engine start, or SES number one. Now, those represent the cutoff of those nine first stage engines that you see burning right now. Those will stop burning. Then the stages will separate once neither stage is burning. And then the second stage, once separated, will start its burn. And that's called SES, or second engine start number one. Those three events will happen pretty quickly in a 10 second span, starting about 30 seconds from now. Again, Miko, separation, SES. Stage separation confirmed. And you heard the callouts and saw the visual confirmation of main engine cutoff, stage separation from those onboard cameras, and then second engine start. And as a treat, we were able to see that green flash from the T-tab that I mentioned earlier as second stage ignited. The next milestone is fairing deploy. I mentioned these earlier, but we're going to jettison those fairing halves because once we're out in space, we no longer need that aerodynamic shield. So in order to become more fuel efficient, we get rid of this unnecessary mass. Vehicle on nominal trajectory. Fairing separation confirmed. And we've successfully had fairing separation. As those halves gently float away, we now have Telstar attached to second stage, exposed to the vacuum of space, continuing on through its first burn.